Hello, Sophia Chili here, and it's time for a Chili update. An update that I should have done, but I was actually rained out. Yes, chili update. Um, we've lost some chilies, we've gained some chilies, things have moved around and we've got lots of different things happening over on the balcony just there. Okay. Um, for a while we've actually been, we were back in the UK um, and we actually asked somebody to look after the house and feed the plants and water the plants and stuff and made sure the things didn't die and stuff. So, uh, but as a result and a side effect of actually having someone look after the house, the plants changed. Mm, they changed. Um, and one of the uh, kind of not a bad side effect, but one of the side effects of of this particular uh, thing was that uh, the grafting process that I was doing, you know, grafting the, um, the seven pots and stuff and the nagas onto the fatellis, um, they were all thrown away because the person who was looking after the house thought they were actually uh, just sticks in the ground. And um, well, you can't blame them; you didn't know what was happening, and uh, that's the way it is. So that's about as far as the grafting process got. Um, later this year, I'll try some more grafting process. I've had a look on the old interwebs and there seems to be a different way of doing it. So we'll try it that way. So, so we're gonna go out there now in this glorious, glorious sunshine of a day. And uh, I'll show you what's around. Out there, it's, it's about 28-ish, 27-ish degrees. And it's a lovely blue sky, which I'll try and capture with the old camera. So, come with me. So, out on the balcony again. This should be familiar to a lot of people by now. Alrighty, let's have a see where to start. Let's start over here. Let's have a quick span of what's happening. This is the grove. It's not as um, I don't know, rainforesty as it was last year, because everything's a bit slow to start. But it's coming. Right, so starting here, this is a bit of uh, oregano we're trying to grow very badly, and a bit of rosemary. Oh, it smells lovely, that rosemary. Mmm, oh, sage onion stuffing. That's what, that's what rosemary reminds me of. Plants, some other plants. There's some little baby chilies here. We've got some nagas. Um, here is a chocolate hab. Some more chocolate habs and scotch bonnets. So they're, they're doing okay, that's chocolate hab. They're doing all right, I have to pot those up later because they're getting a bit big. The cactuses, they're, they're growing, but they are dying as well. But there you go, that's life. And another cactus there, I think it's just a, a husk. I don't think there's anything in it now. And I've decided to grow, or was given, Basically, what's happened is that all the chilies that I had have been repotted, so I haven't got a clue where anything is. And I've been given a load of new chilies, and I don't know what they are. So, this is some kind of um, black pearl, and it probably is uh, a little black, a true black pearl, rather than one that I grew from the seeds last year. And this here. I don't know, but it's got little flowers on, and again, that's purple, so it's probably a black pearlish type thing as well. And I think these ones <coughs> here are from the seeds of the black sea chili that I grew last year, so I don't know. But they're doing okay, let's we'll see what happens with those. And over here is another one, again, it's growing, it's got little flowers on. No idea what that is, anyone's guess. This is good old fashioned lettuce, which is proving a favorite for the caterpillars here. Uh, some parsley in the background, some uh, coriander here, which has gone a bit wild. Oh, lovely. And some more chilies here. Now these ones, I don't know what they are. They could be scotch bonnets, I haven't got a, not a no idea, but they're nicely growing. All nicely lined up in a row. Yeah, they're good, but they're small. You can see they're small. And one of them had a small chili on it. 
don't know which one it is, but there you go. And there's some basil in the background. And we have here some, uh, I think these could be for tellies. But they're so small. They should be like up here somewhere. But they're not, they're little baby things, so it's a bit pathetic this year. And this is a plant called Lovich. It's grown here. It's used for something, I don't know what it's used for. And this one here is used for making jam here. It's got like a lovely rich, I don't know what the smell is, it's like a, like a fruity, like a naturally fruity smell. That jammy taste, that's what it is. That gives you that jammy taste that you actually have in jams. And in here, if you can't really see very well, I'm trying to grow some, uh, some carnivorous plants. We seem to have the weather for it. Can't really see much, but they're in there. There's a couple of things growing, and they're only really, really, really teeny tiny little things. I can't really show you them on camera. Maybe later I will. Uh, and so, and we have finally down there some cactuses. And here we have, this is spearmint, I believe, or peppermint, one of the mints. And some more parsley down there, and a bit more lovage. And that's it. So, there we go. That's the update that I was going to do a few days ago, but um, I was rained and hailed off. just couldn't hear myself. Alrighty, so uh, that's the state of play here in Sofia. Uh, I'm off to go and see a bridge being opened and uh, I'll leave you with a shot of the nice blue sky. Isn't that grand? Classic blue sky. <laughs>